So totally, I've been doing this. Oh, that makes sense. Go do it again. Hey, I'm Delmar Wood with RDL Trucking. I've been in this thing for 15 years, guys. I made a ton of money. I had some of my best years the last few years and just learning the tricks and trades of what works and what doesn't, right? And um, I had my best year in 2018. 2019 was wonderful for me. I made $60,000 in three weeks, right? OTR Capital, I've been with them for five years. They only showed me love, love, love all the way through, guys. They're an awesome company to be with. And just know, let's make some money, 2020. All right, guys, this is the opportunity. I need you guys to stay tuned so you can understand and learn how to capitalize on what's going on right now. We in high demand, very high demand. A lot of people can't work. A lot of people can't get out and do have an opportunity that you guys got. And I'm gonna show you a few tricks, few tricks on how to get your rates up and make, a, a make I'm gonna guess about a 30, 40% profit. I don't know how you feel about it. I know it's wonderful for me to make a 34% profit. Let's do it guys, let's do it. I'm gonna show you the tricks on it. Stay tuned, let's do it. First things first, if you do not have a portal of some sort like Trucker's Edge or Truck Stop, get one. This allows you to understand what's going on in the market right now. Having Uber Freight and TQL, having those just going to their sites, just getting their loads, you don't understand what's out there, what's happening. It's great because you get a lot of the pocket postings that they got. You can get it first for them before they put it on that. But you need to understand, it's so many other things that's going on right now that you need to know. It's a lot of hot loads, a lot of spot loads, and that's when you go on the low boards and grab those things off. First things first, when you get up in the morning, you wanna make a post. First thing, 8 a.m. is always the best time. A lot of times the brokers get in around about 9 a.m., 9.30, Eastern Standard Time. I found the most success for me is around 8 a.m. I want to be the first thing they see when you get on that low board. And here's some of the tricks I do to kind of get their attention. I throw, I put my post up, right? And I refresh it like every 15 minutes. So you can go to the edits, you can go back and refresh, and I want to be the first one up there. A lot of times when you make a post and you let it sit there, it goes stale. It goes down to the bottom of the list. You gotta imagine wherever you are in the world, you are competing with two, three, four hundred drivers a day. So if we're all posting around the same time, nine, nine thirty, you can imagine your post is moving down to the last page, six or seven page. So what you need to do is get there early and refresh that thing constantly. And and, and, then, and then you can be even creative and start throwing different things in and your comments, things like this. How what I do when I see posts. I look at the rates up there and I say, okay, I got a feel for what they're doing. Atlanta to Charlotte. I see a hundred loads up there and I say to myself, okay, what is the rates they're posting? Okay, I, if I call them, the power was in, in their hands. So now what I do is I put, I make a post and I tell them about me. So I say, uh, driver empty. My rate is this. So once you put your rate, which of course in this market right now, you want to go up. If the rates are saying five or six up there, you see the posting, you want to go up two or $300 at least because right now it's a shortage of drivers. You got a lot of older drivers are not driving at the moment. You got a lot of drivers just afraid. Guess what? That means a shortage of driver. You're in demand and you should post it like they need you, which they do. So what I do is I go up two or $300 for what I see on there and whoever calls me, the power is in my hand now because now you're coming up to my rate. I'm not coming up to your rate by calling you. Now, it is times when you need to call them, but right now in this market, they should be calling you and you should be matching that refresh button so your name and your company is up there first. 8 a.m., make it your job to do that. You be first on that list when they see you. So. First off, like I told you, you put your comments there, you put driver empty, you put the rate there, two or $300 more, right? So when they call you, they're gonna negotiate up to your rate now. They come to your rate, not their rate. Their rate was 400, but your rate says 700. So if you call me, I mean, you're entertaining my 700, right? So if they say, oh, I didn't see your comments, I say, stop there. Can you read the comments before we go further? And they'll go down there, read the comments and say, ooh, either that's too high, which they always say, or they say something like, hmm, I can get you 600, see that? From four to seven, we made it 600 now because he got it posted four. That's a little trick that works for me all the time. Do it, you'll love it. By you posting your rate, it cuts down on the cheap freight calls that you get. Those cold calls, you're gonna minimize those cold calls by at least 80% at least because now you're telling them, I'm not moving that rate 400, I'm not doing it. 
I'm doing it for 600, right? I'm doing it for 700. So most of the people on that, on that, on truck stop, they're reading your comments and they're not gonna call you. It cuts back on time from that street freight call that you get. And you just, you can move forward, moving on, doing different things. Another way to get great rates is if you're already out there and you got a good track record with these brokers, they will love to use you again in this market because they're looking for dependable drivers like yourself. So you can use that as leverage to say, look, I deserve 600, I deserve seven, I deserve a thousand, right? Because I've been doing this already a couple of years, four or five months, and I have a great track record with y'all. So you know when this load, when you give me this load, it's in good hands, right? So then you can use that as leverage. You can use somebody else who haven't been out here for a while. That's 50-50. But if you use me, you know you're gonna get great service. Use that as leverage to get more money out here, y'all. We deserve it. We deserve it. We've been through a whole lot. 2017, 2018 was a great year. 2019 was extremely slow. 2020, it's, it's curving around for trucking. It's a demand. They need us now, finally. And now the, the power's back in our, in, our, in our lap here. Let's use it, y'all. Use that as leverage in order to get better rates. I got a great track record, TQL. I got a great track record, Co Coyote. Check me out. I'm, I'm an elite with TQL. I'm an elite carrier. Yeah, I'm a diamond carrier. Make sure you use that. Sell yourself because you've been working hard this whole time. Now you can use this leverage to get better rates. Big question, right? Delmar, how do I set my rates? I get it. I get it. You don't want to be too high. You don't want to be too low. And you want to be profitable somewhere in there, right? Especially on this market in 2020. OTR data porter systems, right? It's amazing. They take all the information that's what's going on in the country at this time and they put it on their poster and they, they let you know what the average rate is going for. You gotta imagine this factory company right now, they're looking at everything that's coming in, everything we're doing, and they say, okay, the rates are rising. So that allows you to see what's going on and what the price is. So you're not too high and you're not too low. Definitely check it out, y'all. Hey guys, I hope those tips really help you guys out, right? 2019 was slow for us, but 2020, we're gonna see plenty, right? All right, if you wanna follow me, follow me at Trailer Strong on Instagram. Check out everything I got going on, content, all the things I got stirring up. I put all kind of great tips out there. Hope to talk to you guys soon. God bless. Let's do it, y'all. We can do it.